Hi, I'm Jake Drongle, I'm 27. I'm from the Bay of Islands and will be representing Northland this year. I work for the Landing and I also have my own wine label, 144 Islands. I started working in viticulture when I was about 14 at Mars in the state in Kiri Kiri as part of a school program. I studied in Auckland and travelled and, and returned back to the Bay of Islands five years ago where I've been working in viticulture ever since. I think the New Zealand wine industry is in a pretty exciting place at the moment. Uh, but in 10 years time I think we may see ourselves at a, at a fork in the road where we might need to take a look at ourselves and decide whether we need to be bulk producers of wine or producers of ultra premium wines and I think there's a lot of potential for us to, to up our value per bottle and dominate the export market. I'm really proud to represent Northland, particularly this year uh, because this is obviously the 200th centenary year uh, since uh, the grapevines were first planted here. Obviously the wine industry has flourished since then and it all started here in Northland so to carry that flag forward and have the opportunity to sort of showcase Northland on, on a national scale is going to be really exciting. What I love about the Young Vit competition is the opportunity I, I get to meet a lot of uh, interesting and, and fascinating people that are in the wine industry, uh, both sponsors and, and other growers and winemakers. Um, I've made a lot of mates, I've had the opportunity to get out of my little bubble here in the north and meet a lot of really cool people, so it's, it's all about the people. I'm Zoe, I'm 25 years old, I work at Pegasus Bay Wines and I'm representing the North Canterbury region. I got into viticulture straight out of high school, I started studying at Lincoln University and then I went away and worked in Marlborough to finish my studies at MIT. Since then I've worked really all around the South Island and I've done a few experiences overseas as well. My career goals would be to one day end up managing an organic block in North Canterbury and have a great team underneath me making great wine. In 10 years, I see the New Zealand industry as having a real focus towards organics and sustainability and really progressing ourselves across the world stage to make the best wines. I love North Canterbury because I think we've got the coolest little region here. It's got everything. It's got the mountains, it's got the people, it's got the great wines. It's got just the real passion behind what we're doing. Competing in Young Vit has been such an experience of growth and challenge for me. I have learnt so much and made so many friends and I've really just seen what I'm capable of achieving and it's been really wonderful to feel like I'm growing up through the competition from when I first entered when I was 21 to, to now. Hi, my name is Simon Gawley and I'm 28 years old. I work at Domain Thompson Wines in Central Otago and I'm representing Central Otago. I got into viticulture around 10 years ago when I studied at Lincoln University and a Bachelor's of Viticulture and Enology. My initial lead into viticulture was when my grandparents bought the old Faro vineyard site in central Otago and the stories of the hidden wine cellar there got me interested in winemaking. Since university I've worked at two paddocks in central Otago along with Central Otago Wine Company doing winemaking and a small stint in Australia and vintage in Burgundy, France. My career goals are to be a leader in sustainable vineyard practices uh, along with organics and biodynamics. I'm proud to represent Central Otago because this is the region that I love and want to spend my career in and to be a representative for that uh, would be a big honour for me. I love the Young Viticulturist competition because of the sense of community we get and the chance to meet other peers in our industry and industry leaders and spend quality time with them learning. In 10 years time I see the New Zealand wine industry as having a really defined place on the world stage producing extremely top quality wines competing against the old world. Hi my name's Nick Putt, I'm 23 and I work for Villa Maria in Hawke's Bay. I got into viticulture probably when I was about 16, 17, I kind of was thinking about what I wanted to do and had a cousin in the industry and spent a little bit of time in my holidays just working with him and seeing what it was all about. I studied at Massey University, did a Bachelor of Agricultural Science majoring in horticulture. From there I did a little bit of work placement with Escarpment in Martinborough and then started a cadetship with Villa Maria in 2016. Where do I see the wine industry in 10 years? It's a tough question, it's such a diverse industry. All regions have different 
specialties that they will specialise in and different strengths. It's hard to say, but I guess looking at technology will change quite a lot. Wine varieties could change, but I think they'll probably stay quite similar. Um, it'll more to be towards with what's happening with labour and how we're going to best uh, mechanise these uh, processes. I'm proud to represent Hawke's Bay because it's a, a strong region and one which has produced some pretty strong finalists in the past who have gone on to bigger honours. So it's pretty cool to start here and kind of push forward. I love the Young Bit competition. It's a great way to meet like-aged people in the same industry, uh, doing similar jobs. It's also fun just to compete against them in a competitive way, but also in a friendly, fun way and kind of see how you compare to other people. Hi, I'm Ben Richards. I am 24 years old and currently working for Indivin down in Marlborough. I got into viticulture just kind of by chance really, so parents dairy farm up in the Waikato and so wanted to work outdoors but didn't want to milk cows and I really enjoyed science and travel and so it kind of put everything together and so then I went down to EIT in Hawke's Bay to study the Bachelor of Viticulture and the Bachelor of Winemaking. My career goals are to progress through the industry further and further, so currently as Grower Liaison Officer with Indivin I'd like to kind of stay there for a little while and then gain more experience and more knowledge within the industry and then move forward. I'm proud to represent Marlborough because we are the biggest wine producing region in New Zealand and there are a lot of young people within the industry down here that are really enthusiastic about the industry and really knowledgeable as well so representing Marlborough was kind of representing all of them as well. Uh, the Young Vic competition is great because there's a lot of people to meet, uh, whether it be the sponsors, other competitors or leaders in the industry and just make lifelong friends and contacts within the industry. Hi, my name's George Bonnet. I'm 28. I work at Craggy Range and I'll be representing the Wire Rapper. How I got into viticulture, I first went to Lincoln uh, down in Canterbury. Uh, I did the three year BVNO. After that, I ended up in Central Targa. I have worked in Central for about five, six years. I've worked over in Australia, uh, up in the Waikato, here in Martinborough, and uh, over in Austria. I'm proud to represent the Wairapa just because we're such a small little community here. Everyone really gets behind each other, uh, and again, the product here is outstanding. For the future, I see myself um, hopefully growing organic grapes, uh, potentially here in uh, Martinborough if it's possible, trying to produce the, the best quality wine we can. What do I enjoy about the Young Vit? Uh, I like the, the competition factor, uh, as well as just learning what you do and what you don't know, uh, and, and the ability for the younger guys to come through and, and test themselves, it's, it's cool. It's really cool.